my very dear friend, Professor Muhammad Yunus, dear participants of the Summer of Purpose, we have all gathered today to celebrate the life of you, my dear friend Muhammad Yunus. What a life! And even on your 80th birthday, you are showing your unwavering commitment to make this world a better place. I would like to join all the many friends from around the world to congratulate you very warmly on this birthday. All my best wishes for the best of health and of course for super happiness. At the same time, I would very much like to thank you for your active cooperation with the International Olympic Committee. We are united in the vision for a better world for all and we share the same goal to make the world a better place through sport. The fact that unfortunately I can only greet you virtually today is itself a reflection of the unprecedented situation we all are facing because of the global coronavirus crisis. While we are all living with uncertainty, it is clear that this situation is having profound implications for all parts of society. This is why this conference comes at an important and most appropriate time. The pandemic has shown us all that the global community needs new ways of thinking, new approaches and a new sense of purpose. I hope very much that the first lesson we all learn from this crisis is we need more solidarity. Solidarity within societies and solidarity among the nations of this world. Solidarity is at the heart of the Olympic Games, which unite the entire world in all our diversity. Solidarity is also at the core of social business. The concept pioneered by you, Professor Yunus. You have always been and you continue to be an intellectual driving force for a just and inclusive world. You are always challenging conventional thinking and you are always challenging us with this. You are always pushing for social progress in innovative ways and trying to pave the way for super happiness. In this Olympic spirit, I wish you all fruitful discussions. Happy birthday, my very dear friend Muhammad Yunus.